Hi, my name is Madison Kreitz, and today I'm going to be sharing with you some helpful hints to help your kindergartner uh, learn the proper way to work with scissors and the proper way to cut. Now the first step in teaching them the proper way to cut is teaching them the right way to hold their scissors. So they need to realize that since this circle is smaller, only their thumb can fit in, and since this circle is larger, two or more fingers, depending on which one they feel more comfortable with, can fit in this. So when they start cutting, they can um, have one finger up here if they feel more comfortable, or they can just have it inside or just hanging out. So when it comes to time to actually learning how to cut, what most teachers have realized is that kids have always watched other people cut, and so when they start cutting, they want to cut towards themselves. But obviously that is not the right way to cut. So what we have to teach them and a good tip is to stand behind your child so they can get the point of view um, while you're teaching them the way that they would be doing it. So when you start cutting with them, just have them start snipping some pieces of paper. They can just go like that and eventually they will start to realize that they can't just keep snipping the pieces of paper. They will have to eventually start moving their hand to make um, longer strides and make bigger cuts. So when watching your child cut the piece of paper, make sure that they are actually watching what they are doing because most kids will get really distracted and look at something else while they're trying to cut and they can't cut straight line or they might even hurt themselves by not looking and paying attention. So make sure that they are really paying attention to what they are doing. And the second tip is to make sure whatever um, their less dominant hand is, make sure they're using that hand as their helpful hand. And they're holding the piece of paper with that hand instead of just trying to cut just with one hand because obviously they're not going to get very far with that. So once they finally get the hang of cutting, you can actually start teaching them to just cut a straight across line. So make sure that they are once again watching their paper and using their helpful hand to hold the paper and make a straight across the line. Most kids will start to get a hang of this um, just the more and more that they practice. And once they have finally gotten the hang of using, that, using their hand to cut the piece of paper, they will start feeling more comfortable cutting out shapes and um, cutting out other pieces of um, art. And so when they are starting to feel more comfortable with this, you can actually draw a, a rectangle or a triangle, something with straight edges. Now you don't want to use a circle yet on a new, on a kindergartner who has just started cutting because that is um, too much turning of the paper to really, they wouldn't really understand. That would be very hard for them. And so you can start with a rectangle and just have them learn the motion of taking their helping hand and turning it so that they, they can go the other way and have them turn it again and then they have their rectangle or square or triangle or whichever shape you cut out for them and once they start um, getting more advanced in their cutting you can start using circles or start printing out um, cutting sheets that they can practice cutting out different characters or anything else that um, you would want them to cut out. And so I hope that this really um, helped you learn and helped um, just give you some tips on things that you can help your kindergartner with. Thanks.